Hi, I'm Kim from EverythingEtsy.com, and today I'm going to show you how you make this simple crochet flower. There are a million different ideas for these, but let's just follow along and, and you'll be able to make your own in minutes. So you start off with a simple slip knot on your hook. You're going to crochet seven, chain seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and for our little loop, our little center part, we're going to slip stitch into the very first stitch that we made. So we go through, yarn over, and pull it all the way through to create a nice little circle. And that's what we're going to be working into the whole time. Okay, so it's really pretty easy once you get start going to kind of once we make the first petal or two, you're going to be all set. So we're going to chain two, one, two, double crochet by yarning over, going through the center, yarn over, pull it through. That gives you three loops on the hook. Yarn over, go through the first two, yarn over, go through the second two. That makes a double crochet. Do it again, yarn over, through the center, yarn over, back through, yarn over, through two, yarn over, through the last two. And it's looking pretty good. Do it again, yarn over, through the center, yarn over, back through, yarn over and through the first two, and through the second two. Now we're gonna chain two. One, two, and we're going to slip stitch right into the center. So go through, yarn over, bring it through, and pull it all the way through to finish off the very first petal. We do the same thing. We're going to stitch, uh, sorry, we're going to go two, two chains, a double crochet. Each one will consist of chaining two and creating three double crochet and then chaining two again and finishing off with a slip stitch. So that's how each petal is going to work. So make sure you go three double crochet. So that's our first part, a chain, two chains, double crochet, three of them, chain two, slip stitch right into the center, bring it through, by now you're getting the hang of it. Just mush it around there a little. Chain two, double crochet. I'll go a little faster now. Crochet, double crochet, chain two, and slip stitch into the center. Go. Move it around a little. Chain two again for the next petal. Double crochet. Double crochet again. And the third double crochet. And chain two. Slip stitch. When you get four on there, it gets a little tight. Don't be afraid to really push it over. Chain two, double crochet, double crochet, and one more. Chain two, through the center, slip stitch, and then I pull it tight, cut it, pull it all the way through, pull it again a little bit. I'm going to go from the back and take the yarn to the back. Flip it over, tie a knot. Don't worry if it looks a little wrinkled, ruffled looking, we're going to fix that. Cut that. 
Here we go. And we just kind of mush it, pull it, tug on it. You can do, it's very tough at this point. So there you go. You've created a crochet flower. And you can find the written instructions on the blog at everythingetsy.com. Thanks so much. I hope you had fun.